Well, the Pacific, I mean, the, this race is five and a half thousand miles if you make a direct route. And um, it's a big ocean, the North Pacific. People don't realize it's just the same as the Southern Ocean. You get just as bigger waves. And if you get the low pressure coming in, it's just as windy. So it is a, a big thing to take on uh, for many of these crew, probably the furthest they'll ever sail in their lives. Yeah, I can't believe it's here, finally. Um, we're really, really excited to get there. Uh, there's just a, a small challenge of four weeks sailing across the Pacific in the middle. So, no, it, it's sort of an endurance, endurance race, really, that we feel we're going into. So, um, you know, the crew are definitely in a really, really strong mental state. They're ready for the challenge to come and ready to face it head on. I've been quite nervous to be honest, um, it's, you know, this, this leg is always kind of known as the big one. Um, I don't think it's going to throw much at us that we haven't been through before, but I'm still really nervous about it. It will be really hard, it will be challenging, but we've seen tough weather already. It's more the duration, you know, possibly 28 days, and we're going to go through sort of a forefront system, so it's going to get progressively harder, and that with, I think, the inaccessibility of land. So it's always on your mind that you're miles away from anything. But yeah, I'm gonna get ready, get ready mentally for it. On the Miley Pacific, what I expect is cold, some cold, then some more cold, um, and some big seas. Generally, this is the roughest leg out of everything, so it's gonna be tough. Um, we're ready for it though. Um, I just can't wait to get it done. We had a bad race last race, we had to pull out because we got knocked out, a lot of damage to people, or two people, and the boat. So hopefully, I want to sail across it this time all the way. This will be uh, it, <laughs> my uh, kind of prime experience I've been looking forward to. I'm trying to eat up and fatten up a bit because uh, I think the, the hardest bit is going to be partly very cold. Um, and trying to prepare for that is, is very different. It's the first time we really will face this type of cold weather, so that's going to be interesting and hard. No, I hope I'm prepared. I got my uh, my fleece onesie and my sealskin waterproof socks and my hand warmers, unlimited supplies, so hopefully that will help. Uh, but it's, it's intimidating. It's intimidating. So to know that the closest humans will be in the space station is, is quite interesting. Um, but I think we'll make do. Uh, thank God that we have satellite communications, I'll say that. Uh, so they'll be able to listen into anything that we say. Um, but otherwise we'll make sure to be safe, pay attention to everything on the boat because we know that we're so far away from everything else. And uh, you know, take it day by day and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll make do.